family and friends. How are you? I hope you and your family are safe and happy too. Welcome to season two of Auntie Oni Story Village, where everyone lives in peace and love. I'm Auntie Oni, your favorite storyteller, and I love sharing stories, poetry, and music from villages around the world. I can say hello in many languages. Can you? Repeat after me and learn something new. Ni hao, makadi, guten tag, namaste, hola, bonjour, nainzio, ciao, yo manima, sawubona, tashidelek, haya. Did you hear hello in your language? If you didn't hear Auntie say hello in your language, let me know and I'll give it a go. Auntie Oni's Story Village is for children of all ages. So listen up. Today I couldn't wait to share with you two of my favorite poems, The Sparrow and The Farm Child's Lullaby. Both were written by Paul Lawrence Dunbar. I dedicate The Sparrow to all the people who have to work from home. In Dayton, Ohio, during the cold winter months, Paul Dunbar used to write his poetry at a desk by a window in his home. A little brown bird would fly to his outside windowsill to say hello to him. So he wrote The Sparrow. A little bird with plumage brown beside my window fluttered down. A moment chirps its little strain, then taps upon my window pane, and chirps again, and hops along to call my notice to its song. But I work on, nor heed its lay, till in neglect it flies away. So birds of peace and hope and love come fluttering earthward from above to settle on life's window sills and ease our load of earthly ills. But we in traffic's rush and den too deep engaged to let them in with deadened heart and sense plod on nor know our loss till they are gone. The Farm Child's Lullaby by Paul Lawrence Dunbar. I dedicate this to Indy, Levi, Miles, and Tyler, and all the beautiful little ones who listen to Auntie Oni's Story Village. Oh, the little bird is rocking in the cradle of the wind, and it's by my little wee ones by. The harvest all is gathered, and the pippins all are bent, and it's by my little wee ones by. The little rabbits hiding in the golden shock of corn. The thrifty squirrels laughing bunnies idleness to scorn. You are smiling with the angels in your slumber. Smile till morn. So it's by my little wee ones, by. There'll be plenty in the cellar. There'll be plenty on the shelf. By my little wee ones, by. There'll be goodly store of sweetings for a dainty little elf. By my little ones, by. The snow may be a flying over the meadow and the hill. The ice has checked the chatter of the little laughing rill. But in your cozy cradle, you are warm and happy still. So bye, my little wee ones, bye. Why the Bob White thinks the snowflake is a brother to his song? Bye, my little wee ones, bye. And the chimney sings the sweeter when the wind is blowing strong. Bye, my little wee ones, bye. The granary's overflowing, full as cellar, crib, and bin. The wood has paid its tribute, and the axe has ceased its din. The winter may not harm you when you're sheltered safe within. So bye, my little wee ones, bye.
Thanks for listening and invite your family and friends to Auntie Oni's Story Village. Subscribe wherever you get your podcasts. To let me know how much you enjoy my labor of love, write a review and give me a bunch of stars on Apple iTunes. Want to see Auntie? Visit AuntieOni.fun. Stay safe, and I'll see you later, sweet potato, after a while, honey child.